Money, particularly in the form of bills, has been an integral part of economies around the world for centuries. The United States dollar, known for its economic prowess, stands as the most widely used currency in international transactions. Remarkably, over two-thirds of all $100 bills circulate outside the United States, underscoring its extensive global reach. The history of U.S. bills is a journey marked by constant innovation and adaptation. Originating from the early 1690 U.S. colonial bills, these notes have undergone significant transformations. This evolution primarily aims to combat counterfeiting, leading to the development of complex designs and advanced security features. From straightforward IOU notes to today's high-tech, intricately designed bills, the evolution of the U.S. dollar bill reflects both technological progress and the changing needs of a global economy. So, how is it made? The journey of a U.S. bill begins with its raw materials. The primary material used is a unique blend of 75% cotton and 25% linen, ensuring durability and a distinct feel. This blend is crucial as it gives U.S. currency its strength and longevity, with each bill designed to withstand approximately 8,000 folds before tearing. The sourcing of these materials is a closely guarded process involving suppliers who specialize in creating this unique paper blend. Unlike regular paper, currency paper is embedded with tiny red and blue security fibers to thwart counterfeiters. These fibers are an integral part of the paper and are added during the initial mixing of the cotton and linen blend. This process ensures that they are distributed evenly throughout the paper, making it extremely difficult to replicate accurately. In addition to the paper, specialized inks are used for printing. These inks are formulated to adhere to the unique currency paper and have specific properties like color shifting and raised printing, which add to the bill's security features. The ink is sourced from secure facilities that specialize in high-quality, durable inks capable of enduring the wear and tear typical of currency circulation. The combination of these raw materials sets the stage for the intricate process of turning plain sheets into secure, recognizable currency. In the initial processing stage, the unique currency paper is first primed for printing. This involves a pre-treatment process where the paper is conditioned to ensure optimal ink adherence. The conditioning typically adjusts the moisture content of the paper, an essential factor for the upcoming high-precision printing. This preparation is vital for ensuring that the specialized inks, particularly the color shifting ink, adhere correctly and display their intended security features effectively. Meanwhile, the specialized inks are prepared. The color shifting ink, a key anti-counterfeiting element, undergoes a complex blending process. This involves combining specific pigments and additives to create an ink that changes color when viewed from different angles. Simultaneously, the intricate engraving plates that will transfer the bill designs onto the paper are meticulously prepared. These plates are crafted using a combination of advanced computer-aided design and traditional engraving techniques, ensuring each detail of the bill's design is captured with precision. The preparation phase also involves setting up and calibrating the sophisticated printing presses. These presses, designed for high speed and precision, are adjusted for exact alignment and even ink distribution. This meticulous setup is crucial to achieving the high standards of quality and consistency required in the printing of currency bills. The manufacturing of U.S. currency bills combines precision printing and sophisticated security features. The process starts with offset printing, where intricate background patterns and colors are applied to the currency paper, forming the bill's foundational design. Following this, the intaglio printing phase adds tactile texture to the bills. This technique involves inking and pressing engraved plates onto the paper under high pressure, creating raised features, particularly in the bill's portraits and major design elements. Security features are central to this stage. Watermarks unique to each denomination are embedded within the paper. Security threads with denomination-specific colors and positions are also integrated, often featuring microprinting for enhanced security. A key step is applying color-shifting ink used on denominational numerals. This ink changes color depending on the viewing angle, a critical anti-counterfeiting measure. After printing, the sheets dry before being precisely cut into individual bills. Sequential numbering is then added to each bill, 
serving as unique identifiers and aiding in tracking. The process, from the initial printing to the final cutting and numbering, ensures that each bill is not just a medium of exchange, but a secure, durable representation of value. Once the U.S. bills are printed, cut, and numbered, they move to the final stage, packaging for distribution. The bills are systematically counted and bundled into stacks, typically of 100 notes each. These stacks are then wrapped in protective bands, clearly marked with the denomination and total value, ensuring easy identification and handling. The bundled stacks are further grouped and packaged into larger containers, often secured with tamper evident seals for added security during transit. This packaging process is designed to facilitate safe and efficient transport to various Federal Reserve Banks and other financial institutions ready for circulation.